Hi, my Barbaloots. Welcome to Friday Circle Time. Today's Circle Time, we are going to start with feathers for lunch. What do we see on the cover of this book? What animals do we see? A red bird and a black cat. And look what's on that cat nose. What is that? A feather from the bird. This book is by Lois Elhart. Uh-oh, door is left open, just a crack. What do you think that is coming across the page? The cat's tail. My cat is out and he won't come back. He's looking for lunch, something new. Looks like that bird is finding lunch. What is that bird having for lunch? A worm, a spicy treat for today's menu. There goes kitty cat under that blue jay. His food in a can is tame and mild. He's trying to hide behind the flowers from that cardinal. So he's out for something wild. He's snooping and sneaking. Those birds sure look good. If he could catch one, he'd eat it. He would. But when his bell jingles, the birds call a loud warning. Like there goes his feather. The kitty cat must have a bell on its neck, on its collar. They cried to each other, the birds, they cried out, they said, big cat got out this morning. But cats can't fly and they can't soar. And birds know what their wings are for. He's trying to catch that hummingbird, but he just can't reach. So he keeps prowling, hoping to munch. But all he catches are feathers for lunch. Look at all those feathers all around him. The end. So before we move on to our next book, I thought we should be going over our shapes, make sure we stay on top. So we're gonna go really quick, are you ready? Let's see how much we got. What shape is this? Rectangle, too short, too long rectangle about this one diamond about this one it's not a circle because circles are big and fat ovals are skinny see that it's an oval this one's easy what's this a heart and this one circle this one has one two, three sides, because it is a triangle. And our next one has same, same sides all around, because it is a square. Our last one is a star, a estrella up in the sky with our crescent moon. So our next book today for circle time is one of our favorites, How Do Dinosaurs Get Well Soon? Let's see, are we ready? This book is so silly. What if a dinosaur catches the flu? Does he whimper and whine between each achoo? What kind of dinosaur is that? That is a Cyracosaurus. Does he drop dirty tissues all over the floor? Like the Gallimus dinosaur? Does he fling all of his medicine out of the door? Ooh, he's not taking his medicine. That Parasolophus. Does he flip off his covers with tooth and with tail? Eusophilus. Does he dump out his juice and get sick in a pail? It's a brachiosaurus. 
does a dinosaur wail like the Dilophosaurus? What if a dinosaur goes to the dock? Does he drag all his feet until his mother is in shock? Does he hold his mouth closed when the doctor says open wide? Does he scream? Is he mean? Does he run off to hide? Like the Tijuana Saurus. Does he push back each drink, spit his pills in the sink? Does he make a big stink? Is that what you think? No. He drinks lots of juice and he gets lots of rest. He's good at the doctors because doctors know best. Does he uses a hanky on mouth and on nose? He snuggles right down underneath his bedclothes. He takes all of his medicine without a fight. He closes his eyes. He whispers, good night. Then mama and papa tiptoe out the door. Get well, get well, little dinosaur. The end. Alrighty, and before we go, we gotta do our weather for the day because today is Friday. And what is that weather outside doing today? Is it raining? Give also? No, it's not raining today. Is it windy? Nope. Is it cold and snowy? No way. What about sunny? There's some sun today and there's still some clouds. We've gotten pretty lucky. We haven't had any rain this week, really. Just lots of really cloudy days and really warm days. All right, Barbaloots. I will see you another time. Have a great Friday, and I hope you guys enjoy our activity videos we're going to do after this circle time video. Bye-bye.